In just two weeks, Louisville will elect a new mayor for the first time in 12 years. The field is now down to two men. You've got Democrat Craig Greenberg and Republican Bill Deeruff. We've talked to both mayoral candidates several times, but now we're giving them a chance to get candid over coffee. I sat down with both Deeruff and Greenberg at Brew and Sip here in downtown Louisville to hear about who they are and their visions for Metro Louisville. On any given morning, the Brew and Sip Coffee Bar at 5th and Broadway is a who's who of downtown Louisville. Well, hello. Good morning. And on this particular morning. Well, hello, sir. How are you doing this morning? It's Louisville mayoral candidates Bill Deeruff and Craig Greenberg trading in the soundbite style interview for a sit down coffee conversation, a conversation that covered a lot of ground including the uniqueness of this particular race. I am the first mayor ever to stay in the same house and run for a mayor of another city at the same time. On Valentine's Day of this year, an individual walked into my campaign office and from 15 feet away fired six gunshots at me. I am the most fortunate person in the city, in this world, to still be here today. Similar to the conversations many of you are having about this race and our city, public safety is a headlining topic, and both candidates are quick to talk about it. Over 130 people this year have already been killed by guns in Louisville. 330, more than that, have been injured. And thousands of more families and neighbors and neighborhoods have been impacted by senseless gun violence. I have, as a result of that and where the city is, there is no one that will have a stronger resolve than me to work with anyone who wants to be a part of the solution to reduce the amount of gun violence in Louisville. We need to implement solutions large and small. We want to unite both the community and the police together to tell the people that are the hardened criminals that they, don't, they need to be in jail and quit putting the people in jail that don't deserve to be in jail, our drug addicted people. We need to get them help, the behavioral uh, people that have problems. We need to get them help. And we shouldn't pull over the young black male because it's turn signal. That isn't community policing. We need to go after the hardened criminals, the cartel and the gang leaders, and tell them Louisville is not a place for you, and take them on the federal level and get them out of here. Something at the core of any mayoral campaign is vision. So my question, what will Metro Louisville look like or be like in four or eight years after your leadership? We must do a better job of investing in every neighborhood in this city. And so as mayor, looking back on a four-year term, those are some of the things that I hope to look back on as accomplishments that together we all accomplished. What does success look like is if at the end of the term that if somebody asked you where is the best place to live, you tell them Louisville, Kentucky. That means you're proud of Kentucky, you're proud of Louisville, and you want somebody to come here because this is a place you want to live. Right now, unfortunately, our community is looking how do we get out rather than how do we stay. So, and I, and I want to. And, you know, it was not an easy endeavor to, to boil that down into about two minutes. So you can find my full conversation with both Greenberg and Deeriff streaming now on the WHAS 11 Plus app. It's free to download on your Amazon Fire Stick or Roku when you open it up. All you have to do is click on news. You'll see that at the top of the page. Uh, and then at the bottom, you'll see our election 2022 video carousel.